Well, good afternoon, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to Gray Shot Down. I'm Gray Shot Down on the sticks, alongside Dog on Sci-Fi behind the wheel. We are going to take you on another full self-drive aerial perspective video of Tesla's 12.3.3 full self-driving software stack. If you are liking this content, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We all know how that helps this insane YouTube algorithm, and we greatly appreciate it. engaging glad I didn't drink the whole thing of coffee the anxiety shaking mess why? I just know oh, I'm making a joke because I threw off the routine the routine uh, it's all good <clears throat> I will say this much about 12.3 in general. I realize this is a point release. It's been really nice. Mm -hmm. It's never, for me, it's never dropped below like a B minus. Yeah. Well, except for the curves. <laughs> I mean. I'm going to give it a C on the curves. <laughs> there's a few things that can be improved, but I'm saying that like overall. Oh yeah, no, I'm at the point now, and this is a great place to be where you're like, taking apart what it does well and what it doesn't and you're grading it separately right yeah kind of like you would a uh, like a senior writer versus a freshman writer exactly we'll pick that up when we stop <laughs> I'm fine all right excellent haven't done a single thing yeah, because I remember like in these drives, you used to have to do the accelerator tap just to keep the, the car moving through here. Mm -hmm. And I think what's hard to, what's interesting or difficult to portray from um, some of these videos is that we're not doing anything. Nope. You're just simply putting light steering pressure on the, the wheel so that it recognizes that you're alive. But yeah, other than I'm that, honestly... yeah, but other than that, you haven't done anything. Speed okay? Yeah. And we are using the new Automax uh, speed. Which, right. with the Correct, update, right, yeah, with yeah. the update, it's much better. Oh, this 1233 has been great. I forgot you had that camera going. I look like a hot mess today. <laughs> Will you do the auto touch on the edge? Well, remember, it's just a little, <laughs> do, it's just a little <laughs> thumbnail to the viewers, and I we know, look like video game the, avatar players. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you look, I think you look beautiful. Spring break. You gotta give me some grace to do it. I'm just happy you're out help, helping me with this. I can't do this on, on my own. No. no way in hell. I like doing this with you. These are always fun. Oh, don't forget to change your navigation. I know, you gotta wait until you're over that bridge. Understood. Otherwise it tries to get you to go right. Understood. And go through these new beds. And hey, the good news is that you got tons of time now because we usually pick the navigation that's like immediately just after the bridge. Yep. Oh, hey, there's water in the canal. That definitely is my reminder to turn the sprinklers on today. <laughs> if that's not my sign, I don't know what is. I'll never forget though. Your first like winter here, and we saw the signs for like sprinkler blowouts. And you were like, "What's that? What's that? Why would you do that?" <laughs> this is a side story, but it, it was our first summer in our house, and you flooded the yard because we had overwatering. Oh, in our first house, yeah. yeah you were like, that was awesome. Whoops. There we go. 
Papa. All right, so it is windy if you were today. So worst case scenario, we're, we're going to take the scenic route to catch up to Doggone Sci-Fi. Are you doing okay? Oh, I'm perfectly fine on this. I'm just preempting our viewers oh. so that you have... Well, I remember it, it accelerates quickly now. Yeah, quickly. no, it's not just that, but it's me going it's into good. the wind, wind a headwind. I've had a tailwind on this road. All right, let's not cut the corner. We did last time, or just do it again. That's it. Fine there. Sorry, that was an ax. That was an oopsie disengagement. It did fine there. I really wasn't actually trying to oopsie disengage. Yeah, no, that was, that was I fine. just put too much pressure. Now we're at that interesting part where you accidentally put too much pressure and it disengages, and you're like, I didn't even realize I was putting that much pressure on it compared to when I used to have to. Yeah, no, it was doing fine there though. Yeah. That was genuinely an oopsie. We're not going to count that as a disengagement because that was an oopsies. Like I said, viewers, the scenic route. I gotta. You can't do anything about it. It's auto max. I'll catch you. Don't worry. And you got cars behind you anyway. Let's slow it down on some. And remember, I can cut this turn. It is very breezy up here today. Okay, taking the turn. I'm a little close to a curb for my liking, but I did not disengage, which tells you something. Around the garbage can. <laughs> did you find me? Yeah, I got you. Sorry about the little delay as we caught up to Dog on Sci Fi. Again, bit of a headwind. Is that what the red thing on your screen yeah, is? Yeah, that's all it is. I wish I could mute that. Like, honestly, it's annoying as hell to have it vibrate. It's almost like FSD nagging you. <laughs> but we're back. Nice smooth turn through here. And it does get windy in our area, no doubt. Especially right. at this time of the year. Human interaction coming up. We got a lady pushing a baby, so I would give her a little bit more room. Oh, they're turning. Ooh, lady. Cross the street. Cross the street. <laughs> or just keep walking straight so that we can see Cross the street. You. Cross the street. Either one. <laughs> Now we're just gonna let Automax do its thing on this road too. Mm -hmm. Saying that more for our viewers. Cross the street. Damn it. <laughs> All right, we got traffic. Cross the street. Cross the street. And out. There's a truck coming pretty quickly, so I would probably not go. Probably would not go. Excellent. <laughs> Probably would not go. Still would not go. Still would not go. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, we're going. And we're gonna go 35 miles an hour. <laughs> yeah, but to be fair, it's only at 45. Um, I didn't do anything. Just it did well. It did really well. I give that a A minus. I realize it freaked you out, but from the passenger seat, I didn't know shit was going on. Well, so here's honestly like. Just to be fair, play devil's advocate. No, and honestly, here's what it was. It was one of those like, I'm so used to what it used to be, which was I'm going to go and then hesitate mm -hmm. and then cause them to slow down whereas this it was like no i got it yeah. and it got up to speed fast yeah 
up to 25 and then it was like it couldn't figure out what speed it needed to go <laughs> it was like do i go do i not go okay we're here getting in the left lane nice oh a bit hesitant it, and well, we've it seen got, that hesitation a little bit it was going stupid early now i am going to give it the go you don't have to it should do it automatically i didn't do shit that's why i said but I was saying you don't have if, to it should do it automatically were you just prepared yes okay I, I didn't get to finish my statement before you cut me off. I was saying I'm going to give it the go if... <laughs> oh, it doesn't... Yes. Do it automatically. If it doesn't do it automatically. Got it. Oh, this has been a zero disengagement. Right Other there. than the oopsie disengagement. Which I'm not counting. That was genuinely an oopsies. <laughs> well, if you are liking the content, please again be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We all know how that helps this insane YouTube algorithm. I am Gray Shot Down on the Sticks, alongside Doggone Sci-Fi Behind the Wheel. This has been another full self-drive aerial perspective video of Tesla's 12.3.3 full self-driving software stack. Hyphen no beta. <laughs> Hyphen no beta. I've actually, you know, I watched <laughs> other YouTube channels that were talking about, talking about the beta situation and how they were gonna have to get used to calling this FSD supervised. And I was reflecting back, when I title these videos and call them on camera, I actually have always called them full self-driving stacks. Like, I've never actually called them a beta. I've always just called them a version of software. Yeah. So, for me, it was nothing to get used to. Thank goodness. <laughs> but, oh my gosh, I feel for the guys that have had to, had, had to say uh, beta for a hot minute or two. Right. And now that are transitioning over to calling it supervised. These are nice white spots. I appreciate that. They must understand that more. Thank you all for tuning in.